Okay. Good morning, YouTube and TikTok. How you guys doing? I haven't been playing with my railroad in some time period because, like I said, I came across my railroad early in the morning. I tripped and I had some mirrors over there and I fell into the mirror. I'm going to get rid of this mirror too. I just, you know, my hand is, is uh, it's not working properly, so I haven't been doing any uh, moving around and playing with my trains and stuff like that. But I'm going to get rid of this mirror. Uh, this morning I'm going out to film some trains on a different part of my real, real layout in the Northeast Corridor. And I want to show you guys a bridge that needs to be replaced. We're going to be examining this bridge here. I'm going to show you that it's unstable, that it shakes and stuff like that. I'm going to have to contact authorities, and they're going to have to remove this bridge. It's on Haines Street. I've been rail fanning over there for some time, and whenever 18 wheel or something like that comes over, the bridge shakes. The bridge has to be replaced. Something similar to like how the Tampa Bridge takes you over the Hudson River um, in New York. They had to replace that bridge. Uh, this bridge that on Haines has to be replaced. I'm going to be doing a lot of rebuilding on this, uh, this layout. Maybe this uh, week I'm going to get some more switch tracks, some old 27 tracks. I might even buy a train to CXX. I got to make, uh, make a decision whether I'm going to buy a, excuse me, a North and Southern uh, Line G Plus 2.0 or am I going to buy uh, some uh, old 27 tracks to uh, hook up this uh, crossover that uh, has been sitting here for a while. I'm going to be doing some renovation with this uh, railroad. I'm going to put some plat uh, platforms on here. I'm going to have this track, um, put a little bevel on there. My Santa Fe is acting up this morning. I, I don't understand this guy, man. This guy is acting up. This is a dangerous day out here, this railroad. Uh, we were walking across the tracks and stuff like that. That's why I was walking across the tracks and I fell down. So you can take the lid off the Santa Fe and put this on here. Uh, and do some work with the wires instead of taking the whole witch report out. Now I'm going to show you guys something. I feel like doing something uh, Yes, yeah, so now it's working properly. Right? So, uh, like I said, if you see this guy is acting up, the step across track has nothing to do with the wires. It has something to do with the actual uh, inside. Actually, we move this guy. You really mess, you really got me to mess. Uh, okay. So, like I was explaining to you guys, I walk across the tracks on my railroad all the time. I know everything is at. She said I had got up. You see this guy? Guy. Oh man. I'm getting ready to get out of here. I'm getting ready to go and film some trains for you guys. I'm gonna film some trains for you guys. I'm gonna wipe this track down. Okay, stay off. I'm turning everybody off. You got me. Yeah. Yeah, we'll take this guy off. This guy's getting on my nerves. Early in the morning. This guy's getting on my nerves, man. Yeah, I want to show you guys something. This giant fade. You don't have to take off the, uh, the top to start dealing with those wires. You can just take this top off right here. 
you just take this top off. You see I got some um, electrical tape in there. This guy's acting funny. I'm gonna find the short again and uh, get this guy sealed up properly, man. He's starting to get on my nerves, man. Early in the morning doing this stuff, when I'm doing the... Uh... Man. I'm going to film some planes on my real layout. See? This rides right. I'm going to be buying a new train. I'm going to be buying a new train or some track. Or some track this week. God willing. I got to make a decision. Because I want to connect this operation uh, to my bedroom. Right? I haven't been messing around with this track. I've been messing with my real layout. My real layout. Oh, man. My real layout outside, which I'm going to in a little while. Run my real layout. I'm gonna get this thing here straightened up where I have a stepping stone to uh, get on top of and all that stuff. It's gonna be a major renovation I'm gonna be doing over here. Something similar to what uh, those guys are doing at the North Elizabeth Station. I'm gonna be doing a renovation over here, man. Big, big renovation. I got the wood and everything ready. I got the wood and everything. You see this idiot? All right, I'm turning everybody off. Guys. Okay. Turn this here, turn everybody off. I'm gonna deal with you guys this morning, man. Okay. So. Uh. Yeah, I'm going to be doing a, re a major uh, renovation with this uh, railroad, okay? I'm going to get everything straightened out. I have some pictures of my actual hand when it was cut open and the blood on the floor. I don't know if I'm going to show you guys, but like I said, I'm on my way to the Northeast Corridor right now. I'm trying to get there early in the morning to show you guys this bridge, some Amtrak trains. I might even go over to my freight train uh, layout. It's going to be very hot today. That's why I'm trying to get out of here earlier. It's supposed to be 100 degrees over here in Newark. I live on the borderline of Union County and Essex County. Union County, uh, I got to get you guys a map so you guys can be well familiarized with my outside layout. See, I got the track and everything. It's supposed to go to my bedroom. You know, I told you I haven't been dealing with this situation right here, and it's got kind of messed up over here because of my finger and everything. I haven't been dealing with it. But uh, let's go over to the uh, to the real layout outside. Guys, I'm on Haines Street and Friesenheisen in Essex County. I'm getting ready to show you guys this bridge that needs to be replaced. And so happened that uh, these guys are doing some uh, work on there. They got the bridge closed. I guess they beat me to it because I was just getting ready to come down here and show you that this bridge needs to be replaced and uh, to notify the authorities. Yeah, how you guys doing, man? All right. I was just coming down here to film this bridge, man, because this bridge needs to be replaced, brother. The whole bridge needs to be torn down and replaced. I was just getting ready to come down here to make a video about this bridge. Mm -hmm. I'm a rail fan and to notify the authorities that they changed this bridge. When those 18 wheelers come over this bridge, the bridge shakes, man. I don't know how old it is, but this bridge needs to be replaced. Not tar on top of there or none of that. It has to be replaced. Do you agree with me or not? Hey, man, I, I bet that bridge older than me. Well, like I say, I'm coming down here to film some trains, and just so happened that you guys are down here. Okay, like I told you, I was coming down here to film this bridge, this bridge needs to be replaced. This whole bridge on Hayes Street and Fusion Highs in Essex County, uh, uh, the city of Newark. 
Okay, hello uh, YouTube and TikTok. This is the bridge that I was telling you about. You got to see a new work, uh, sanitation, doing some uh, cutting in uh, these weeds and stuff like that because this place is neglected. But in any event, this whole bridge needs to be replaced. I'm gonna show you some of the structure on this bridge. It's not gonna be any trucks coming over here today because uh, because they got it closed down. They're doing some uh, 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 cleanup. You see, that's part of the bridge right there. See that? This thing's falling apart, okay? This thing actually shakes when 18 wheelers come over here, uh, over this uh, bridge. And not only that, believe this bridge is the Northeast Corridor, you see that? The Northeast Corridor, where I film my trains. This part of my layout, this bridge has to be replaced. I'm gonna show you, look, you see this air destruction and stuff there? You see that? Okay, there's more to it. This thing is falling apart. You see this stuff here? We don't got any 18 wheelers coming over here today. But uh, when 18 wheelers come over this bad boy, it shakes. Okay? And if this thing, you see that? This thing, we're gonna go underneath here. You got the Northeast Corridor underneath there too. We're gonna go underneath here. Manhattan is that away. Okay? Actually, I'm gonna, I would get on top of this thing here, but my finger's messed up. Give you guys a good view of this uh, this this bridge and the actual city. Look, let me give you an example. You see this? This thing is not even level anymore. This thing, because of the shaking, right? Because of the shaking. Yeah, this bridge is shot. This thing is not even flat. It's slanted towards this way. This thing is supposed to be flat. Okay. I don't know what they're doing over here on this floor or doing some uh, repaving. This whole bridge has to be cut. This whole bridge has to come down. Okay, maybe we could catch a train coming down over this way, but we're getting ready to go up under this bridge right now. Okay, getting ready to go up under this bridge. So I'm just gonna cut this right quick. Okay, we got a New Jersey Transit. Get ready to go underneath this bridge. And we're going up underneath this bridge in a minute too. We got the monorail over there for the airport, Newark Airport over there. But we're getting ready to go underneath this bridge. Yeah, like I said, this bridge is totally neglected, right? Totally neglected. We're getting ready to go underneath this bridge right here now. They got the bridge uh, closed today because uh, the Newark uh, sanitation is cutting down the weeds and stuff like that. So no 18 wheelers are going over it because uh, when I do my rear fanning underneath this bridge, you could hear the bridge shaking. I'm a builder. I know when the integrity of something is shot and the integrity of this bridge is shot. It's a time bomb waiting to happen. This whole bridge needs to come down. Just so happened today that uh, they closed the bridge so you guys can't hear the 18 wheelers coming over this thing from the port with tremendous weight. You see the structure of this bridge here? This is underneath it. This whole thing needs to come down. This whole bridge needs to come down, you guys. And I'm gonna notify the city of Newark and tell them about this bridge. If this thing was open today and it was 18 wheelers coming over there, you would hear this bridge shaking, man. Shaking. Okay, we're down here to film some trains here. We're gonna see if we can get some more sellers or some Amtrak's coming down here. It's hard to catch them down here because I can't see from afar off. These trains are so fast that as soon as you press the thing uh, to record, these guys are gone. So, uh, yeah, I'm down here underneath the bridge, right? Oh man, these guys are crazy. These guys did some painting underneath the bridge when they need to remove this whole bridge, man. I'm telling you, this whole bridge needs to be removed. 
These guys did some pain and, and patching up. Those beams are shot, man. They're shot. Northeast corridor trains going in up underneath this bridge. Like I told you, the guys need to replace this bridge. Amtrak coming down underneath the bridge. Amtrak coming down. Told you, this whole bridge underneath there needs to come down. These guys painted that thing green up under there. These guys need to tear down this whole bridge, man. He shot. You can't hear no 18 wheelers coming over here right now because, like I said, Newark, the city of Newark Sanitation is doing some uh, cleaning on top of the bridge. So they got to cut, uh, shut down. I wanted to uh you hear, I wanted you guys to hear the 18 wheelers coming across this bridge and you can see this bridge shaking. I'm not jiving around. This is a public safety issue. It's a public safety issue. I think they just put some uh those beams there, they just put some things around and painted it and tried to uh reinforce those I beams. You understand that they're aware of the integrity of this uh, of this bridge that they try to reinforce those I beams. That's not enough, man. Okay, here comes another Amtrak coming down here. Amtrak coming down. Amtrak coming down. Amtrak coming down. Excellent. Look how many rails they got over here. It's got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven rails. Awesome. I like this part of my layout over here. I like this part. I like this part of my layout. Here, let me turn around here. I like this part of my layout. But like I said, these guys beat me to it. Because I was the last time I've been over here was maybe like around... Uh, maybe like seven months ago and stuff like that. It was kind of cold and stuff like that. It's just summertime today. Today's supposed to be 100 degrees. And uh, I noticed the shaking of this bridge. You know, I was so pissed off with these guys about the other side of my layout, me notifying the rail people about that crossover that needed to be fixed. And those guys wasn't paying any attention to me. And uh, they finally got it fixed uh, to notify them about this bridge here. But uh, I just came back over here and just so happened, I'm observing underneath this bridge. And like I said, these guys reinforced those, uh, reinforced those I-beams. You see those black things on there? That's not enough. We was on top of this bridge just now and I was showing you how the siding uh, is crumbling and stuff like that. Uh, you know, pieces of the bridge actually on the actual bridge, okay? And like I said, this thing falls down. This is the Northeast Corridor. You understand? This is where the jam tracks and these cellar trains come by here. Uh, we're going to go down to my freight train area today. Uh, try to catch at least one freight train to tack on to this video uh, before it gets too hot out here today. Uh, I got you guys two Amtraks coming down here. And I showed you guys the bridge that I wanted to explain to you. I'm going to be building some bridges on my layout. I'm going to be building some bridges on my layout at home. Okay, uh, next week, God willing, uh, like I said, I'm going to get some track, some fast track, uh, 027, uh, uh, um, what is that? Not 027, maybe a 2027 track. And um, the fast track, um, uh, 072. I get the 027. I'm all twisted up this morning. Um, 027 track and um, some more track. Or I might just get me a, a, a Norfolk Southern um, a, a, a Lion Chief 2.0. I've been longing for that uh, 
for that diesel engine. Okay. There's a monorail over there. And there was a terrible accident on Freezing Eisen Avenue today. Oh man. Uh, I came out of my uh, uh, home and uh, News 12 was down there. I'm gonna be on News 12. Uh, I pressed the record to record the News 12 and I lost some of the footage. I'm gonna tack that video on here too. But uh, there was a car that crashed into an 18 wheeler. These guys got to be very careful driving, man, on the road, man. You know, people are not vigilant there uh, on the telephones, texting, and all this kind of stuff there. You know, uh, 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 five or six people perished this morning. I'm sorry to hear that. Okay, we're getting ready to get out of here, and uh, I want to get you guys at least one freight train. Okay, everybody, this is another part of my layout. This is a very serious part of my layout here. This is the Northeast Corridor right here. And right over there, that's the Raviton line of the freight train. We're gonna catch a freight train coming across that bridge. The freight train comes across that bridge as these uh, electric uh, uh, high-speed rail uh, comes across. Awesome. And we up, uh, we up on these uh, trains real close here. The set, this is private pro uh, public property right here where I'm standing at. It's the street that comes down here, so nobody can't say anything to me. So this is a good part of my layout we're gonna be seeing. Like I said, right over there, freight trains come across that bridge. And uh, over here, this is a high-speed rail. Awesome. Okay, we got a freight train, we got a Norfolk Southern. Coming across that bridge. Awesome. We get a little bit closer. It's supposed to be 90 degrees out here today. We got Norfolk Southern coming across that bridge. That's the freight train line. And right up under it is the high-speed rail. It would be hot if we catching a cell or an Amtrak coming under that freight train. I'm going to blow this up so you guys can hey, Just blow it up a little bit. This is where, and that train is traveling east. It's going to the port. Because over there, that's where the port is, and that is where Elizabeth, uh, Elizabeth uh, uh, Newark Liberty Airport is. Yeah, let me see if I can blow this up more. Yeah, better. That's better. This is Norfolk Southern going across that bridge. And like I said, below is the freight train line. Let me uh